Whew. It's been a long time, guys. Um, it's been way too long, but I am here with some new things to announce and a new product to unbox, as you can see by the title. It's just kind of a abrupt opening, but listen, I finished college. This is a new era of Cafele um, YouTube channel productions. Cafele Gaming Network coming to you soon. Cafele Network coming to you even sooner because this is the video. Rebranding, redoing things. Let's get into it right now. So, what we got for you today is um, a brand new unboxing as you can see by the title. I, as you may know, as you probably don't know from previous videos, I was um, very much team Apple all the way. I have an iPad Pro over there. I have an iPhone X, iPhone 10 that's recording this video right now because why not? And I had, um, I had, Air, I have AirPods somewhere up there. I have, uh, shoot, I have an Apple Watch. I had a MacBook Air. I had pretty much the whole ecosystem. I just think the only thing I had was a Mac, but uh, I won't be getting a Mac because I have a new uh, bad boy right here that I'm going to talk about eventually. But um, yeah, and then I went on vacation on um, a few days ago and it kind of just like kind of changed my perspective a little bit on of Apple. Not in the way that I was sitting in my car. We was driving to uh, uh, Mohegan Sun. It's a casino a resort here. I mean, not here because I'm not in Connecticut, but in Connecticut. And we was going, and as I was on Twitter a little bit, uh, I tweeted out, if you not follow me on Twitter, it's uh, Kafelisan, at Kafelisan. Also, follow me on Instagram, Kafelisan. Also, Saint underscore Jesus. I have two Instagrams. One is like a more of a uh, fashion blog but um they read i didn't really do too much with it so far but um yeah uh sitting down i tweeted uh i'm bored of apple and i think switch to android and um well i did exactly that with this package right here from fedex who gave me a really hard time today to get this package saying that it was a uh, delivery exception that i didn't um what you call it no one even came, and they claimed that they came, but no one came. So I called them up. But long story short, it finally came in the mail. I got a cheap case from Amazon because I have two more cases coming from Amazon. The Spigen and the leather phone case, but that comes in tomorrow. And I want to get this video done now. And I bought a cheap case just for today so I could, like, put the phone in the case. So I don't, like, I don't drop my stuff often, but anything happened. I didn't even tell you what phone it is. But, um, yeah, so... Yeah, so I said I'm bored of Apple. Uh, I saw that the Samsung Galaxy S10 5G was coming out, and while I don't have 5G coverage where I'm at, I prefer this phone due to the larger screen, the extra camera, 3D camera sensor, whatever that is, true depth, whatever. Uh, supposedly larger battery, but you need a larger battery for a screen this big. So it's kind of the same, almost same results. Um, and... Uh, that's why I got the 5G instead of the, the, the Plus. Um, so yeah, I got a Samsung Galaxy 5G S10, S10 5G. And um, I'm gonna open this bad boy up. But yeah, uh, so this is a big change for me. I mean, I was on Apple forever. I actually have had more Android phones than Apple phones in my lifetime. I had, started out with the Motorola, some Motorola phone that was an like AT&T that had fingerprint scanner. I don't remember the name of it. But um, that was my first Android phone. It was one of the first 4G phones. Coincidentally, that, uh, my first Android phone was one of the first 4G phones. My f Coming back to Android is a 5G phone. So it's kind of the calling for me, you know? <laughs> but um, yeah, so I had uh, that Motorola phone. Then I upgraded to a Samsung Galaxy. Gax Samsung Galaxy S3. Boy what, you, boy, what you doing? Before I jump into everything, this is a, a Lenovo Yoga... 940 um basically the comparator to uh compared to surf the surface series uh this bad boy put me back a couple dollars but graduation money <laughs> um but uh 
this thing is pretty freaking sweet. I'm, I'm gonna do a review on it, but I just got it, so I'm still getting used to it. And I haven't done too much art stuff with it. I used Illustrator a little bit to create this logo. But um, besides that, not too much in depth. So eventually I will get there. But um, back to the topic at hand. Yeah, so then I upgraded to a Samsung Galaxy S3. Uh, I had that for about two years before upgrading to... I only had two Android phones, huh? Well, this now, well, actually, now I'm a part of Android versus Apple because I had the iPhone 6, the iPhone 7, oh, then the 7, then the iPhone. Uh, maybe I had more iPhones than I remember. Cause I did switch carriers at one point, which kind of switched up. Um, huh. Huh. Well, Apple fanboy transitioned back into Android. So, well, let's just get into this. Let's open up this whack case first and save the bad boy for last. My nice skills are probably not the best, so don't judge me. This is a cheap old case that pays, it's cost $6, but I had um, some extra points from my Discovery credit card that I used for Amazon. So I got it for $3. So for one day use for $3 case, I am not, I'm not going to criticize it too much because, I mean, Spigen, I'll criticize the Spigen one because, you know, that's Spigen and decent brand. This is just some uh, plasticky garbage. Um, it looks super ultra thin. The case company, it just says Case Mobile Case. That's the company, Case. You would think that someone else would be have a brand what is this jelly case screen protector waterproof baggie this does not come with a screen protector to my knowledge uh this is the case i mean this is the pretty much simple this thing is slippery well it has a little bit of a grip but i feel like i probably won't be using this case beyond today so um don't don't judge me too much on it that, Boy, I cut way too deep in that, boy. Almost cut the phone off. Like, what the heck is wrong with me? All right. Okay. Uh, guess I'm not that strong. Put that knife away because we don't need it anymore. Let me close it for safety reasons. And let's get into this box here. We have uh, some guy from Verizon. We got some from Verizon paperwork here. Hello, get started on your new 5G phone, upgrade your... I, don't, I didn't upgrade my plan because um, there's no 5G where I'm at, so there's no point. Like I said, I didn't get it for the 5G capabilities. Um, I got it for the screen size and stuff, but when 5G does come here, I plan on to... Uh, I plan on upgrading the plan and stuff like that. Um, yeah. I did decide to keep my current iPhone set training in because I still need iMessage and FaceTime and stuff like that for friends who have it. All my friends have iPhones, so um, my girlfriend too. So to not get it would kind of be uh, disrespectful to her, <laughs> if you per se. What is this? I'm not sure what that is, but get the bus out the way because this is what we're here for. The Samsung Galaxy S10 5G. Boy, I can't wait to see this phone. I am kind of scared to be a... I am am really scared to transition back to uh, Android because I've been on Apple for so long. I don't, I don't know if I'm ready. I, like, I really don't know if I'm ready. Don't accept if seal is broken. Well, the seal's about to be broken right now because I'm about to break your bad boy up. You know what I'm saying? I guess we still need the knife a little bit longer. So this is slice and dice right there. Like you go in this have a frog. Why they like you that second frog? I love animals, so don't kill me, animal people. I love all types of animals. I love dogs, cats, giraffes, elephants, seagulls, you name it. I love I actually do like birds, so I don't think birds are useless like some people do. But uh look at look at ooh. Look at this screen, boy. Oh my goodness. This is a huge phone. This is bigger than the iPhone 10 that I have right now. And I think it's bigger than the... 
I'm not sure the screen size on the uh, X, uh, uh, iPhone XS Max. So it could be similar size. Not sure. Um, but uh, not sure because I didn't. I, I, Apple has not been like. Apple has just not been like interesting to me lately. Like that. the ten S was boring. Um, the eleven might be good. Who knows? I, the those renders are real, but the camera in the back it looks so ugly. Looks is just no. Looks is just one thing. The actual phone itself. I was thirteen now. That could be a game changer. And but really for me, even if it's a game changer, game changer for the phone. I really want iOS 13 to be a game changer for the iPad because that is my daily driver, really. Even though I'm switching over to uh, Android and I even switch over to Windows, uh, I still want to use my iPad because I love that device. That's probably the best Apple product I ever bought. Like, simply, there's no doubt about it. Um, but let's, let's get deeper into this this bad boy here. Let's, let's lift this up the bot. I don't want I don't want to get uh, fingerprints all over it, man. Oh, oh man, here we go. This is the this is bad boy, and in my hand, it fits pretty darn good. I mean, I have rate my hands on a scale of one to five. How big are they? I'm gonna say maybe like a three point five. This phone could. I mean, I'm gonna reach and stuff, but you know, it is what it is, right? It is, it is what it is. And wow, I was skeptical. Sorry, my I sometimes speak funny, but you know that by now. I was skeptical about um the uh why did I put that sticker there? I was skeptical about uh the silver, but my goodness, it's like a rainbow. It's not even silver, it's like I don't even know what to call this, like That's exactly why I got the clear the cheap the cheap clear case so I could see this and wow this is a, a thing of beauty. I have a silver iPhone right now. Um so silver again. But uh there's like a screen on it, a uh, fume protector. But let's see if this case fits first. Probably not gonna fit with that on it, but uh, it does actually, so I doubt it. And the case is uh, a little janky. Hold up. Hold up. That's just a camera ray band. Okay. The case is a little janky, like. Okay, just maybe because of this. No, it's just you. You janked up case. But the good thing is, the cutouts are pretty much accurate, as you can see here. Maybe. I'm not sure if you're focusing. Um, the cutouts are perfect. So thank you for that. And, um,. Yeah, this doesn't cover the camera at all, so it shouldn't affect pictures. It's not a bad case, but I can tell you now, if you could probably see, there's like little to no protection at all. And you can't really get a good screen protector for this, especially glass, unless you want to pay $60 for one. And um, so that's a concern. So this is this there's like no protection at all with this case. So that's why I won't keep it on, because I want protection for this. Near twelve hundred dollar phone. I did not pay that. Only installments. The future. Don't go broke. Uh, also in the box, um, I'm happy first of all that this uses USB C because my iPad, sadly enough, uses USB C to charge, and my iPhone doesn't. Well, it's an old model, but um, even in the future, the next iPhone learning supposedly does not use USB C. So, Apple get your game together. There's a headphone jack. Like even before I wasn't like oh man the headphone jack but then recently recently I lost my dongle and I'm just annoyed but uh this is a I believe this is a fast charging USB type C 2.0 maybe it's not I don't know maybe this is a fast charging I don't really know how fast charging works I'm new to this because Apple don't really have fast charging we should buy it uh, there's another USB USB connector. This is, uh, that's cool actually. So I can like, connect the USB to the USB C, connect it to the phone. That's pretty smart. Android is like having a mini computer. My friend recently told me that, and it's like so true. I miss it. 
And uh, we got some nice Samsung stereo headphones by AKG, the braided cable. I actually want to... I actually want to get the Samsung Galaxy Buds, but uh, um, uh, if I got the black phone, I would have got the black accessories. That's what my brother was telling me about. So slightly enough, I am a little sad that I didn't get the black, but white is pretty, pretty, pretty nice, you know. Um, let's open these things up. This I don't got my keep in here because I don't lose it. But uh, yeah. I don't really need to put the unboxing video, but here's this part. This is my first unboxing, I think it is, so bear with me. Bear with me, we got the cable. And then we got the headphones, which I'm pretty exci excited about because I, I recently lost my headphones, as I said, with the dongle in it. So, there we go. This is a nice braided cable and it got some extra air tips. For those that don't fit in your ears, and I like them. The, the fact that they're all white, that's, I hate it. Because, you know, my ears are clean, but still, never know what will happen. But uh, I will get Galaxy Buds, and I think I might get the white Galaxy Buds. Just to go with the white accessories that we have, so might as well. I think I like silver products, because my iPad looks also silver, too. Um, well, thank you for tuning in. This was an unboxing. I... Could boop the phone, but honestly, I want to do that in my own private time because chill out. I know my package deliver Amazon. Chill. Anyway, I want to just set up on my own time, you know, because I love setting up my phone and just like it's like a private ceremony for me to do it for the first time ever. So that's what I will do. Uh, thank you for tuning in, guys. Appreciate it. Before I go, I do want to talk about Cafeli Gaming Network. Cafeli Gaming Network is going to be a new channel that I'm creating. Um, basically what it is, and also going to have a website or a blog titled KGN, or maybe, what is it going to do, KN? The Cafeli Network? Cafeli Gaming Network? Cafeli Network? I don't know yet, but I'm thinking, um, basically this Cafeli Gaming Network is going to be a lot of, game. it's going to be a gameplay of games. But what I want to do that's different is that in Cafeli Gaming Network, think of it, the network part is the most important part. Think of it as a TV network. Think of it as like USA. Let's say it's USA. Um, USA shows wrestling, they show Law and Order, they show movies and whatnot. What Cafe Game Network is going to be creating content that is basically, basically a TV channel. Like I'm, I'm starting up uh, KGN Wrestling using WWE 2K19. There's going to be a new series coming out, an all original creative a group of wrestlers trying to be the, the best in the world, you know. Um, I have a uh, sim series I mentioned them on that one that's gonna throw up on there too. Finished writing it a few months ago and gotta start filming it. Um, then I think I might do a NBA follow the not in my career mode, but like follow the superstar kind of mode. We're gonna figure it out, man. It's gonna be a cool network, a certain days, certain stuff, it's not gonna be your regular. Gaming channel is going to be pretty different. And um, also with that, I'm, I'm going to be starting a blog, KGN, which is just the acronyms of Kefeli Game, Kefeli Game Network, or KN for Kefeli Network. Still figuring out which one I want to do. And that's where the blog is going to be with about tech, games, everything to do with that. And I think I might, since I don't really want to put these videos, unboxing videos, unboxing videos on the Kefeli Game Network channel, I might make a separate channel and just call it Cafe Network or basically just change Cafe Productions into Cafe Network, which you will probably see by the time it's uploaded, which is will be corresponding with the website of uh, videos, tech videos, tech vlogs, vlogs and whatnot. But all that stuff's gonna happen eventually. Bear with me. I'm back, I'm here. I sounds I'm here to stay, hopefully. <laughs> um I always say that, but I had nothing to do. I finished school, didn't get a job yet. So you know what? Let's indulge in some YouTube, make good content. Hopefully you stick around. Hopefully you stick around. Thank you for tuning in guys. It's your boy Cafele. Cafele, you know, I still got my clone brand. I'm taking a hiatus for, it for right now though. So don't look out for anything new, but your boy's here. See you soon and peace. We'll catch you babies.